What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another episode of Dropping Dimes with Mr. Duga. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and today I'm going to talk about um, the Indianapolis Colts, Carson Wentz and the Indianapolis Colts get beat by the Jacksonville, the two-win Jacksonville Jaguars, 26-11, and with the Pittsburgh Steelers beating the Baltimore Ravens, the, the Indianapolis Colts are uh, are eliminated from playoff from the playoffs, and the Eagles had a first round pick, which will be a higher pick. Um, all of a sudden. Um, before I get into this video, for everyone, if you want to give me a follow on my social media platforms, I'm gonna have all that information down in the description box. May not always get a chance to respond to questions and comments on these videos, so feel free to DM me, and whenever I get a chance to, I'll get back at you. Come highlight at your ball. Also, if you're a Madden 22 player on Xbox One, I'm going to have my Xbox One gamer tag down in the description box also. Uh, Y'all may hear a beeping noise throughout the video. Uh, Please disregard that. And I do apologize for the inconvenience. Wow. <laughs> I must say, man. Um, look, man. When he was in when Philly, man, look, I was Carson Wentz's biggest supporter, yo. Um, I mean, I absolutely supported him. I bought his jersey. Still got his jersey in my closet. Um, just, that was my guy, man. And when we drafted Jalen Hurts initially, I was furious. I really, really was furious, yo. Um, but, you know, the more I think about it, man, um, you know, I like Jalen Hurts a lot. Uh, coming into this season, I just like his moxie. I like the fact that whenever things get tough around him, he seems to rise to the occasion. Um, he's a winner, man. And look, to be honest with you, we don't have the talent that the Indianapolis Colts have. We don't have, um, but we got a really good offensive line. But, I mean, Jonathan Taylor by far led the league in rushing this season. And Jalen Hurts just absolutely did his thing. Was it always pretty? Was it always excellent or great? But he did what he had to do. And Eagles are in the playoffs this year. And meanwhile, um, a real, real struggling Carson Wentz today, all they had to do was beat the two-win Jacksonville Jaguars in Jacksonville. And they they slowed down Jonathan Taylor, and he just had a brutal game, yo. An absolute brutal game. And his team misses the playoffs because of it. And he, we we got their first round pick. If I was an Indianapolis coach fan right now, I would be extremely furious. Because, look, Carson Wentz had moments this year where he looked like the guy. Just like he had plenty moments with the Philadelphia Eagles where he looked like not only a, a, um, a, a, the franchise quarterback, but a, a perennial pro bowler, potential Hall of Famer. And it just came crashing down for him last season. And this year, you know, you got young, you got a young receiver like a Michael Pittman. You got a solid O line. You got a really good running game. I mean, there was games where they won, where Wins threw the ball like, like completed like five passes. And nevertheless, you know, um, he gets be he he gets beat up, man. And and here you have it. Um, just a terrible performance by him today against a terrible football team with the season on the line. That's just really not a good look for him, yo. That's a real, real bad look for him. Um, and I hate to say, I mean, not no, not that I hate to say this, for 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 coach fans' perspective, as an Eagles fan, this is awesome. I'm sorry, but Eagles won that trade by far, yo. A lot of people felt like, you know, you had the guys like the Dan Orlowski's out there saying that uh, the Eagles will regret this. Watch how good Carson Wentz is, that he gets around a, a, a really good roster and has Frank Reich, who is the Carson Wentz whisperer, as his head coach. And Carson Wentz, this is just who he is now, man. He's a guy that's going to give you really splashy plays every now and then, but he's a guy that it seems like it's going to come up short, man. And that's just what happened with him today. He just really came up short. And as an Eagle fan, look, I don't like a lot of things how we do, how we has done. I mean, we had to see J.J. Ortega White and Jalen uh, Rager at that first hand last night just, you know, absolutely stink up the joint. <laughs> you know, you feel me? But 
one thing he got, he got what he, he got a first round pick for Carson Wentz, man. And you can't, we got to tip our head to Howie for that because the Eagles are in the playoffs with Jalen Hurts. The Colts are not in the playoffs and the Eagles have their first round pick. So tip my head to Howie for that, but I'm still not completely sold on them. But we did win this trade with the Colts. Uh, but with that being said, yo, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Hit the like button for your boy. Give me a subscribe. I have Philadelphia Eagles, NFL, and content on my other teams throughout the year. Y'all have a blessed one. Fly Eagles, fly.